line. What a finish. Cole Custer, first win of the year. Comes in from Oregon. What a battle. Uh, but he did a good job racing Cole clean. Cole didn't move him out of the way. He was just a, the benefactor of, of what happened in turn one. He's pumped. Look at him. This is what Cole Custer came back to the Xfinity Series to do, is to prove he belongs in the Cup Series one day. He's here to win, and he got it done today. Yeah, what a day for, for Junior Motorsports. Look at that. Second, third, and fourth. So good recovery for all those guys today. Cole Custer has been on an absolute roll recently. But he just couldn't get over the hump and get the win. He does it today. It's his 11th career victory and his first on a road course. Better watch out. He's doing all those donuts. All those other guys are good. He's pumped. He doesn't even know what planet he's on right now. of Cole Custer. He hopes that he just gets in too deep to 12. Cole didn't do it. He didn't take the bait. Well, and I think part of why we see it look like Allgaier did such a good job is that Cole knew he had a little bit of a lead. It was like, don't do it, John Hunter Nemechek, right at the end of that first stage. That corner was really slick, and you saw a lot of guys run up there all day long. Allgaier made a five tenths on that last lap on Cole Custer. Super impressive lap to put together. So fitting. That was exciting to be that these two drivers win back to back because of the expectations that they brought into the season. Yeah. The frustration, the disappointment they had to deal with. And now they both know they're championship eligible. Come September, they'll be going for the big prize. For Cole Custer, this changes everything. All the pressure of the season, the points. on the other side of the pit wall for many drivers today. And, and the one that's going to have the hardest time sleeping has got to be Justin Allgaier to be oh, so for sure. close. Yeah, and he didn't do anything wrong, right? I mean, he go, you know, Clickerman just got in a little bit deep and, and ran he and Creed off the, off the, the track into the, the penalty area. That's such a good moment to share with your guys. I worked so hard. Just the ultimate payoff right there. Thank you, JT. Good job, brother. Jonathan Tony there, the crew chief. These two have been friends for a long time. Great to see JT celebrating with Cole. Jamie? And as Cole Custer still tries to get his helmet off, his crew guys walk away with a lot of emotion on their faces after watching this win. The crowd still on their feet after those burnouts. You had to start at the back after changing that tire at the start of this race. Able to drive through the field, you only led four laps, but what did you see that gave you the confidence to go for it on that restart? Uh, I mean, just try not to make mistakes. I mean, I did the same exact thing. I mean, I drove, I saw him drive in there so deep, and I did the same thing like two restarts ago, and man, I'm just so happy. I've never won a road course race before. I've been so close so many times, and it's just awesome to win this. I can't thank Haas Automation. Everybody is Stuart Haas of the Xfinity program and the Cup program. Uh, it's just a great day. QT, it's his first win. It's a crew chief. It's it's awesome to get this trophy and get that out of the way. So uh, I'm pumped for the rest of the year. We got fast cars. We're starting to put it on again. Yeah, we got two more road courses in a row. Congratulations.